Ludlock's ready. He is a master of sworn engagements and a warrior beyond fear, but he is not a leader of the chapter. The Forge Master speaks the truth, High Marshal. Grimaldus is flawed by hesitation. A second's delay in all he does, and it is no secret why. He holds himself to his master's standards. Doubt clings to him, darkening his place in the chapter. He is shaken by Mordred's death. He seeks his place in the Eternal Crusade. In the coming war, I will give him the chance to find that place. Time has come for us to choose where we will die. Then let it be where we will be remembered. Let it be where our deaths will matter, and give birth to tales worthy of being recorded in humanity's history. I know of a place. It is far from here, but there is no holier place on this entire world. There we shall dig our graves. And there we will ensure the great enemy forever remembers the name of the Black Templars. Hell's Reach has weeks left, but little beyond that. The siege is almost at our own gate. We received a message from the Astartes commander in the city, the Reclusiarch. He sends word that his knights are en route to stand with us in defense. The Reclusiarch is bringing the Black Templars here. Yes, Priris. Hm. Did he happen to say why he felt the sudden wish to fight alongside the Order of the Ardent Shroud? No, Priris. I suspect it ties into Colonel Siren's decision to break up the remaining defenders into separate bastions. The Reclusiarch has chosen the temple. I see. I doubt he asked permission. No, Priris, he didn't. Typical Astartes. Hmm. When do they arrive? Before sunset, mistress. Very well. Damn it all. Well, don't just stand there gawking, girl. Prepare my battle armor. How long has it been since you wore your armor, Priris? How old are you, girl? Fifteen, mistress. Well then, let's just say you couldn't wipe your own backside the last time I went to war. But it'll be good to deliver a sermon with a bolter in hand again. to the Emperor's Champion of the Hell's Reach Crusade. 
My leash. Primus. Still breathing, I see. Nothing on this world will change that, my leash. Arise, brother. The day will never come that you must kneel before me. Arterian, Bastelan, it is good to see you both. And you, Nero. Kador's fall tore at my heart, brother. He and I served in the Sword Brethren together. Did you know that? I knew it, my leash. Kador spoke of it often. He was my oldest. Well, well, well. The Emperor's chosen. Come to stand with us at last. Hail, Prioress. I am Prioress Sindel, and in the name of Saint Silvana, I bid you welcome to the Temple of the Emperor Ascendant. Reclusiarch Grimaldus of the Black Templars, I cannot help but notice that you do not sound welcoming. Should I be? Half of the Temple District has already fallen in the last week. Where were you then, hmm? Yeah, we were at the docks, you ungrateful little harpy. Be at ease. We were, as my brother Primus explained, engaged in the east of the Hive. But we are here now, when the war is at its darkest, as the enemy approach the Temple doors. I have fought with Astartes before. I have fought alongside warriors who would have given their lives for the Imperium's ideals, and warriors that cared only for accruing glory, as if they could wear their honor like armor. Both breeds were Astartes. We are not here to be lectured on the state of our souls. Whether you are or not doesn't matter, Reclusiarch. Will you dismiss your fellow warriors from the chamber, please? There is much to speak of. We can speak of the Temple's defense in front of my brothers. Indeed we can. And when the time comes to speak of such things, they will be present. For now, please dismiss them. Remove your helm, please. Tell me why I should. Because I would like to look upon the face of the man I'm speaking with, and because I wish to anoint you with the waters of elucidation. A moment, please. This water is thrice blessed. It brings clarity of purpose when anointed onto the doubting and the lost. I am not lost. I did not mean to imply that you were, Reclusiarch, but many who come here are. Kneel, if you would. I cannot reach all the way up there. You have beautiful eyes. There. You are blessed, and may tread the sacred floor of the inner sanctum without guilt. May you find the answers you seek in the house of the God Emperor. Very few left. There will be enough. Have faith in your brother's blades, Bayard. I have faith. I am sanguine with my fate, Chaplain. My rank is Reclusiarch. Use it. By your will, brother, of course. But we stand vigil over the city's death with a handful of bleeding humans, Reclusiarch. I am sanguine, but I am also a realist. Have faith in the people of this city, champion. Such condescension is beneath you. These people are fighting for more than their homes and lives. They are fighting for their ancestors' honor, on the holiest ground in the entire world. 
The survivors of this war across the globe will take heart from sacrifices made by the thousands destined to die here. Blood of dawn, Bayard. The Imperium was born in moments such as this. My voice was one of the few that spoke against your ascension to Mordred's wreck. I would have said the same in your place. We got cut off from Saren and the others. Throne, there are still thousands of the bastards out there. And that's not the worst of it. Explain. The enemy still has Titans. And there's one you'll never believe until you look upon it with your own eyes. We saw it march from Rostrick Ironworks collapsing habitation towers in its wake. Move inside and see to your wounds. If the end is coming to these walls, you will need to stand ready. Oh, we'll all be ready. The bastards took my face, and that made it personal. Madness. Reclusia. Humans, they are a mystery to me. As soon as it has recharged, my princeps. My princeps, we must disengage. We need to rearm and call the plasma core in standard sustained venting procedure. No more leeches. I do not care. I'm ready. Firing. Wait for the stabilizers to come back online. They only need another minute. The arm isn't badly damaged. I'm taking a shot. I can make it. You'll miss, Val. Give them 30 seconds, just 30 more seconds. Firing. No, no, no. This can't be. You've killed us. I had the shot. I had the shot. You son of a bitch! Why hasn't it fired? They said you would be here. 
I beg the many forgivings of this holy place for my intrusion, but I bring news, yes? Do not be angry. The Vox is still playing many unamusing games, and I could not speak with anyone in any other way. Speak, Legionnaire. The beasts, they are coming in great force. Many are not far behind us, and I have heard Vox chatter that Invigilata is leaving the city. Why would they leave us? They would quit the city at once, if Princeps Zaha was gone. Mechanicus politics. She is gone, Reclusiak. An hour ago, we saw Storm Herald die. moment, please. You are destined to either survive this or die at least sometime later than I. Oh, uh, what is this? My mother's wedding ring. And a letter of explanation. Once this is over, if you are still drawing breath, please find Trooper Natalina de Mosca of the 91st Steel Elite. You will recognize her, this I promise to you. She is the most beautiful woman in the world. Every man says so.
black sword! Priamus! Reclusiac! You are the last Emperor's champion of the Hell's Reach Crusade. Now, recover your blade. No secondary weapon systems and suspensor lift capability is limited. Alone, I can fire it no more than once every 20 minutes. I need to recharge the fuel cells manually and regenerate flow from the plasma containment. Heed these last words, Forge Master. Do not bring the weapon too close. The Temple District is naught but fire and ash, and we are surrounded on all sides. Flee the city. Pursue Invigilata's retreating forces, and link up with the Imperial Assault along the Hemlock. You wish me to run? I wish you to live rather than die in vain, and save a weapon precious to the Imperium. We will be buried here, Jurisian. There is no dishonor that your fate is elsewhere. For Dawn and the Emperor. By your will, Reclusiak. I have dug my grave in this place, and I will either triumph or I will die! 
No pity! No remorse! No fear! Armageddon. They call it the Season of Fire. The ash wastes are choking with dust from roaring volcanoes. Fighting across most of the world is ceasing. Not because of victory or defeat, but because there can be no arguing with Armageddon itself. In a handful of days, no man or Xenos beast will be able to breathe in the wastelands. So the war ceases for now. Imperial forces consolidate the territories to which they still lay claim, and drive the invaders out from those where the orcs have managed to grasp no more than a weak hold. Hell's Reach is one of these places. Hello, hero. Greetings, Andre. Perhaps you should salute me now, though, yes? I am not beholden to a guard, Captain. But congratulations. Yes, I know, I know. But I must be offering many thanks for you keeping your word and telling my captain of my deeds. An oath is an oath. Uh, your friend, your love, did you find her? Yes. I did find her. I am glad you made it. I heard you were very injured, yes? Not enough to kill me. The reports I have heard indicated no one else survived the fall of the Basilica. Yes, that would make for a wonderful story, no? The last Black Knight, the only survivor of the greatest battle in Hell's Reach. I apologize for surviving and breaking the flow of your legend, Reclusiak. I promise most faithfully that I and the six or seven others will be very quiet and let you have all the thunder. Were you not injured at all? Yeah, I had a headache, but then it went away. This makes me smile.
Artarium, Priamus, Bastila, Cador, Nero. Forgive me for living while you all lie cold and still. We are judged in life for the evil we destroy. It is a bleak truth that there is nothing but blood awaiting us in the spaces between the stars. But the Emperor sees all that transpires in his domain. And we are judged equally for the illumination we bring to the blackest nights. We are judged in life for those moments we spill light into the darkest reaches of his Imperium. Your world taught me this. Your world and the war that brought me here. Hero of Hell's Reach, the crowd cheers. As if there is only one. 